Hello everybody, welcome to quite possibly, probably, um, I don't know, the smallest haul you'll ever see from me. This is a collective haul from the month of November and <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't do a lot of shopping for myself this month and you know what, that's fine. So I have two shops to share with you of Crest Press and Scribble Prince Co. as per usual. Let's just hop in. I'm sorry, I know it's not crazy. Um, so the only thing I have from Crest Press is a Christmas kit. I had one extra opening in my Christmas lineup this year. And so I was like, you know what? <sighs> I'm going to narrow it down on Crest Press. So I picked this kit because it was super cute and I really liked it. And I felt like a lot of the kits I'm using this year are very... Um, either muted or like classic Christmas colors. So I went with this more like brighter Christmas colors. So I do have a freebie in here in silver foil, super, super cute, like Christmas icons, some scripts, holiday photos, Christmas movies, visit Santa. Ooh, I should save that for next week. Uh, bake cookies for Santa, open presents and Christmas decorations. I'm just gonna pop it in right here. I put all of my like freebies and stuff up front just so I remember to use them and then this is the candy cane kit so I did get two of the extras I can never I never know what 15 millimeter strip to get she gives you a few options so I always just like randomly decide so I randomly decided on this light blue I also always get the glossy paper and her full size kits um, I got the brunette full box and then this like I said is the candy cane kit it's very like classic Christmas, but it's more pastels. It gives me more like, uh, I don't know. I wouldn't say kid vibes. I was gonna say kid vibes, but I don't think that's very necessarily true. But I think it's really, really cute. Here are the full boxes. I love this box here with like the flat lay of the treats. Oh, I love these ornaments. Those are super cute and like the milk and the eggnog and everything. So I just thought this was cute. This is a good um, kit to slot in. Here's the deco. These colors are extra cute. I have like a light pink peppermint, um, I think foil bundle actually coming from Hannah to use with this kit because I think it would look really, really cute. These like papers are very simple, but really, I mean, I still love them. Oh, I love that. Really cute. Oh, there's four. Perfect. Um, but yeah, I get the full size kit. Oh, see, the blue does work really well. <laughs> I should probably start looking at the bottom washi. I like that. Oh, I like the cloud planner too. So yeah, this is getting slotted in for this year which I'm really excited to be using. I think it's really cute. And like I said, it does give me lightly like kid children vibes, which is kind of nice because I got two of those, you know? And, um, oh gosh, can I not put it in? But yeah, so I think this will be perfect. And I don't remember what week I have this for, but you'll see it <laughs> in a couple of months. And then lastly from SPC, I don't have a lot, but I do have some things. Um, I have a couple individual bags of extras that I've brought home over the past few weeks of releases. We'll go through those first. Um, this one has this Doodle She 801, which is like the Christmas um, holiday kind of like assorted sheet, which I really like that she did this because I have a lot of options. And then I did bring home some of the characters. Yes, and also a Scribbler. This is Scribbler 68. I think this is Amelia, number three, and her little Christmas sweater. And then I brought home all the Christmas characters that were released this week. So 126 through 129. So 129 is Ralphie. I think Ralphie's adorable. <laughs> I love him. 128, Kevin from Home Alone, Christmas Story. 127 is Cindy Lou Who. The Grinch was available forever ago, so maybe like last year. I don't know. But I like that she did Cindy Lou Who as well. And then 126, which is Buddy the Elf. I'll leave those there. And then this one here, I literally only brought home one thing. I brought home 120, or no, 132, which is Frosty. The Snoopy one was really cute, but I don't watch Charlie Brown or Charlie Brown Christmas or anything, but Frosty, obsessed. So I had to grab that. And then the last little like individual bag that I have here from, you know, the weeks of bringing stuff home individually. I have, I brought home an extra of the Target script sheet because I was running super low on mine. I just get mine in black. And then this character is, oh, this, this was probably first. This is 66, which is the little witches. It's perfect for Halloween. Doodle number 794, which is the Thanksgiving sampler, which I'm obsessed with these little pies. I, like I really just, those are so cute. And then the character for this week was 160, or not 167, 67, which is the scribbler with the turkey, which I love. And then the three characters are Halloween. So 123, 124, and 125. 125 is Frankenstein, Freddy, because there's already Pennywise, and Ghostface, Beetlejuice, 
lot of good characters, but it's good to have Freddy. And then we should get um, Saw, Jigsaw. And then 123, which is Casper, which I love Casper. So that's like kind of all the extras that now I have to put away, but they look so cute. So my nice little stack of extras. And then I have three kits. These three are probably getting slotted in for January. One of them I'm a little bit iffy on putting in January. I might save it. But at first we have Winter Kisses, which is oh, what I saw this art. Whew, I lost my breath, took my breath away. It was so beautiful. I knew I had to use it. It is so, so pretty. So extras wise, I did grab Fam 3. I love this box so much. Um, the fashion, I love when she, Jess draws hair like this. She did it for a Valentine's Day art a couple of years ago. And I was obsessed with it. And then, of course, the doodles. I like to have the fashion boxes on top, though. Okay, here's a little freebie. Oh, me. So many options. Okay, and then here are the full boxes. I'm just kind of obsessed, honestly. I love the claw clip. I love the shopping bags. The purse is extra, extra cute. This is so beautiful to me. I just... I can't wait to use this. I'm so excited. This is definitely getting used in January. I'm slotting it in immediately after this video. I straight up cannot wait. Oh, little bow pattern. <gasps> That's so pretty. And I'm pretty sure Hannah does have like little bow underlays. If I don't use the snowflakes, bows would be extra cute. Oh, the snowflakes are cute though. And I love that because you could totally put a quote there. But I have so many box options. If I need an extra box, that will be <laughs> one wild week. But that is winter kisses. I couldn't, I mean, this art, I just, I can't breathe. It's so beautiful. The next one I'm definitely using in January is Winter Warmth. This is Darcy Art. This is, I love Darcy Art so much. And when I saw this, I got so excited because it's just so pretty. So again, with the extras, um, this is Fashion 2. I brought it home, I think Fashion 2 specifically because I wanted this girl with the um, like kind of darker chestnut brown hair. Sorry, my lights aren't that great. And I love her purple hair so much. And then the doodles. Oh, I forgot there was a yellow in this kit. That addition is gorgeous the freebie and here are the full boxes oh, this is just so pretty and like i don't know it's like not necessarily jewel tones but it's like lighter jewel tones and i'm kind of in love with it here i should probably actually show you you know what i'm saying so there's that oh this green is everything and i just love the like little shine on the pieces i love the cats oh that's actually really cute I'm kind of obsessed with that um these colors are really pretty um oh i don't know if i want to use checker underlays but i'm sure hannah has like oh even like the star like a moon and star underlay celestial from spc could even be great the leaves would be a great i'm just trying to figure out my underlay situation um i don't even know what foil oh, that's so pretty that's so pretty too i don't even know what foil color i would use with this maybe silver maybe rose gold i don't know this is winter warm warmth yes winter warmth from spc i'm obsessed obsessed with this art i also i do have the i mean i for the most part every month bring home the mystery kits but i don't include them in my hauls because i just never know when my hauls are going to go up and i don't want to accidentally spoil it for anybody but i do have the december mystery kit obsessed with that art i've been staring i think we printed that kit like months ago i've been staring at that part for forever and i'm obsessed with it and i can't wait to use it and then the cyber monday mystery kit is so freaking good when you guys see it you're going to melt the mystery kit the foil that comes with it there is also a foil extra that comes with it it's just oh my god i i'm totally using both of those potentially back to back honestly um they're so good so just know i have them okay and they're amazing i also have a ton of foil bundles too but i'm so far ahead on collating foil bundles that like i don't know when any of those are getting released and then the last kit i have to share is walking in the rain i know jess initially made this for people that might not necessarily get snow in the winter time um we're predicted to get a bunch of snow this winter <laughs> the what is it some almanac is that right <laughs> that doesn't sound right i don't know something about we're supposed to have a really wet winter so it's supposed to snow but I feel like this would be a great April kit. Well, April's usually pretty busy for me. March, September, any time kit for me. So I have fam three here. I mean, they're so cute. I love her little scrunchie. And the doodles, I love these colors. The tall box, she's every, I love her. I love her boots, I didn't even realize her boots. Extra cute. Yeah, this is super cute. Very like rainy day book 
vibes, cozy vibes. This would even be a great kit for like if you're sick because like the tissues, is that odd? I don't know, I love that bed. Um, yeah, oh my God, my cat looks like that. Like, you see how dumb that face is? That's literally, my cat has that face. It's so cute. Um, I love the socks. Okay, sorry. Oh, I just, all the little rain droplets would be such a good underlay option for this. So cute. Yeah, I don't know when I'm using this. Like, I'll, oh my God, my cat looks like that. I'll probably slot this in for January, but I it will be something that I'm not gonna be scared to bump. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is a kit that I won't be like, sad to bump but i will always have it because it's so cute so this is walking in the rain you guys that's my haul isn't that sad well it's not sad it's it's good it means i'm spending money elsewhere and you know paying bills and such but like four kits and a couple extras that's my haul that's my haul um but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed i'm excited to slot these in i actually feel like yeah this is probably gonna get put in for january because as of right now i can't think of any other art that might be out that's like winter -y. I don't know. I don't know, guys, but I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I almost said plan with me. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.